This tutorial will introduce the segment widget. The segment widget is a UI component, which is commonly used to display lists or pages of data. It is a container that provides the capability to define a row template that is repeated for every row or page of the segment. In this example, we will create a contact list with the template containing a picture, name, city along with a few other fields. This tutorial requires Volt MX Iris 2.0 or above. Let's start by dragging the segment widget onto my pre-built form. To design the segment row drag an image and label widget onto the segment. You can skin the widgets inside the segment in the same manner you skin a widget that is placed directly onto a form. We will also set two different colors for the segment row skin and row focus skin. The row focus skin is displayed when the user touches a specific row now. Let's assign some data by using the master data property. I can assign data by either using this master data table view or by double clicking widgets inside of the segment right from the canvas. The segment widget provides an option to give a template to a row or a section which helps to achieve a common look and feel for each row or section. The row template is comprised of containers which can include other widgets. We will first design a row template and then assign it to the segment. To create a segment row template select the segment option under the templates tab in the project explorer. A segment template requires that a flex container be at the very top of the hierarchy so that you can place what is inside of it. You can skin the widgets inside the template in the same manner as you skin a widget that is placed directly onto a form. Once the segment template has been defined select the segment properties back in the form and assign the template to the segment. In our app we have added an on-click action on the segment and have mapped it to the form navigation. Now that we've made a few changes let's again run this app to see how it looks like an app preview. This tutorial is the first part of a three-part series. In the next tutorial we will learn about the segment widget KPIs events and some other UI features. Please refer to Volt MX documentation for more information.